Title, Logitech's Leading Light Logs Off, Stock Stumbles. TLDR. Logitech's shares tripped over their own cable and took a nosedive, losing 8.6% value after CEO Bracken Darrell decided to swap his Control Plus Alt Plus Dell keyboard combo for a snazzy new opportunity. Guy Jetsch, a seasoned player from the board, steps up as the interim skipper while the company searches for their next high scorer. Everyone is familiar with Logitech, right? Those guys who bless our lives with super comfy, high-precision gaming mice and whisper-quiet keyboards that don't alert everyone in a 10-mile radius that we're sneakily chatting on Discord during a work call. Yeah, those guys. Well, our beloved tech wizards have hit a wee bit of a speed bump. The boss man himself, Bracken Darrell, has decided to hit the proverbial escape key on his tenure and is chasing a new power-up somewhere else. Darrell, who's been at the helm of the ship since 2013, announced his decision in an after-dark statement, which is sort of like slipping a note under your roommate's door when they're asleep, right? But fear not, fellow tech nerds. The joystick isn't left unmanned. Board member Guy Jetch is stepping in as the respawned CEO, at least until a new player can level up to the task. Is it going to be a walk in the park, though? Or are they about to face a Dark Souls-esque boss battle? The announcement had the same effect on Logitech's shares as someone shouting fire. In a crowded theater. Yep, they plummeted a whopping 8.6%. I mean, we can't blame the market entirely, can we? Imagine finding out your fave gaming company's head honcho is jumping ship, wouldn't you panic a little? But hey, let's not rush to click the uninstall button just yet. After all, Logitech has been around since 1981. They've seen the rise of the internet, Y2K, the dot-com bubble burst, and even the advent of RGB lighting in every piece of tech gear you can imagine. They've battled through these level ups and boss battles before, so this is just another quest, right? Also, let's take a moment to remember that the gaming industry is no stranger to swapping out key players. We're looking at you, Konami and Hideo Kojima. And if Metal Gear Solid can continue, in some form, without its legendary creator, who's to say Logitech can't overcome this little hiccup? But what does this mean for you, my joystick juggling comrades? Well, apart from possibly feeling a little disoriented in the immediate aftershocks, it's just another day in the gaming industry. But hey, I'm just reporting the news, not making the predictions. So, what do you think? Will this be a game over situation for Logitech, or just another boss battle they'll conquer? Are you ready to watch the epic saga unfold? Or are you clutching your Logitech G500 and 2 Proteus Spectrum for emotional support? Let us know in the comments. Disclaimer, this article does not provide investment advice. All content is purely informational. Always do your own research and consider your own circumstances before making investment decisions.